hello traders hello guys welcome to my channel in this channel you will learn about money management trading support and resistance candlestick psychology money management and other these amazing stuff that, that are giving you for free so this information will help you to become profitable in trading so this is eager price action trader guys please subscribe to the channel and like the video watch till the end because today we will discuss about the difference between trading and investing this is very important especially for new traders or traders that seek additional knowledge so this will be a helpful video so hope you will enjoy so watch till the end so i have read this code that raise your standard that's right how do you raise your standard have more income more that will improve your quality of life and absolutely you will raise your reputation okay this is the this is uh, a code that have that have been created by tony robbins a a greatest speaker in the world the first the only one okay you also have eric thomas he he is also good so raise your standard which is raise your value give the best of yourself give 120 percent and you good to go you will have a better life and you will succeed in everything you do so today we will discuss about the difference between trader and investor if you look at the definition of the terms investing and trading there is no difference this is the same so but is investing is spending money investors so it, it means that investing it is where is spending money with the hope of generating some larger profits or return in the future okay trading is the act of buying or selling investment this is selling investment and stock for example selling or buying usd or gdp gpp okay so let's see the difference between a trader and an and, and investor so period okay the first uh, the first difference is period trading is a method of holding stock for a shorter period of time it could be one week or more often day traders hold stock till the short term high performance whereas investing is an approach where they work on buy and hold principle okay investor invest their money for some years decades or even longer period so short term market fluctuation is significantly in the wrong running investment approach so an investor is is someone okay let me make it simple so trading is short term and uh, investing is for long term for example if if you uh, if an, an investor invests money in a company okay they will get a return after five years or more so traders uh, differently if they invest okay if they invest in any currency they will get the money in short period for example one week okay so this is the period tra trading is in the short term and investors is in the long run so okay so um an investor is someone who plays money in something and look profit from that assets growing over time whereas a trader is someone who made money in the short term by buying and selling stock frequently so traders focus on market volatility investors focus on depreciation or appreciation which is an overtime for example 10 years 15 years that will give them return so let's see the capital growth trader look at the price movement of stocks in the market if the price goes higher traders may sell the stock simply tra trading is ta is form part of the timing of the market where where as invest investing is the art of creating wealth for example if you invest in real estate this is an investor you create left wealth sorry in the long run by compounding the interest and dividend over the years by holding by holding high quality stock in the market for example if you purchase if you purchase 
many stocks and you hold it years and years the stock will grow in value then investor will make money but trading is different Tra trading is you wait the price to go up and you may sell the stock to get pro profit okay you buy low you sell high this is uh, very simple so sadly we will talk about the risk undoubtedly okay both trading and if investing imply risk okay both trading and investing have risk okay however trading is comparatively involve a higher risk and higher returns as the price might go up high or low so in the short while so trading is more riskier for a traders because the price in the short term might go up or oppose his betting decision so since investing is an art because it takes a while to develop okay investing is an art okay where it takes a while it a long time to develop it involves comparatively lower risk and lower return in the short run so investing compared to trading give the investor lower return okay investing is for the long term okay so in investing uh, traders might have deliver a higher return uh, investing deliver a higher return by compounding interest and dividend which is had a longer time period daily market cycle do not affect the quality of stock investment for a long term so in so um invest investment it is where they add by compound interest and dividend which is held for a longer time for example 10 years and then even the market cycle it cannot have much effect on the quality stock for a longer time so let's see about art and sorry art and skill so let's learn it in this way I'm, i have given you an example trading is one day cricket match while investing it is a test cricket okay trading in is one day cricket match okay investing is a test cr cricket so you would watch skillful player in the team okay who are expected to extract four or six to score a higher in one day okay in one match sorry whereas the art of games is seen in the test match similarly traders or skilled technical individual who who, ha who have been in the market many times learn about market trends support and resistance they are very skilled okay they know how the market will behave okay this is a skill of traders so traders are skilled because they learn many things in the market okay over time they know how the market will behave okay they know the psychology of the market investors in on the other hand analyze e stock based on past data on historical data and they want to invest in and okay th these have a probability of, of even go high or down in 15 years so investing include learning business fundamental commitment to stay investing in the long term so this is the psychology psychology of the running of the business so traders put money in the stock for short term they buy and sell fast to hit the higher profit in the market. Missing the rock may lead to loss. Okay, they look at the previous present performance of the company to hit a higher price and then book the profit in the short term. This is buy low and sell high. This is is done by trading. So they look at the present performance of the company to hit higher price and book for short term profit okay investment on the other hand keeps themselves away from the trend they interest in value in 50 years the value will increase or decrease they are interested in value not in trends not in price they are interested only in value so they invest for a longer period of time keeping an eye of the on the stock they hold and they patiently wait the stock reaches its full potential ultimately the one who achieves their financial goal are successful for example if in 15 years uh, the value have go up they will make a lot of money because th in this w they can make a lot of money what is this why it keeps showing i don't know okay going back to our story they are they are the one who decide Trading is seized at a higher price, making a simple profit in the short term. 
is your goal. So to make it simple, investors 